Welcome back to Spicy Tech. I am Mark. I'm Cry. And today we are going to do a. Oops. Am <laughs> I supposed to stop here or there? Yeah. That's here. confusing. <laughs> yeah. We're going to do a downtown trip with 11.4.4 uh, running on assertive mode. Let's uh, let's start it and let's see. Giving us some jewels to get through here. She's taking her time and we have... Oops. We have a hole right there. There's and she's kind of leaning behind. to the right side. So I'm going to have to disengage there. Okay. So we're going to re-engage now. And what she wants heck? to go through the red light. <laughs> Hello. So that's the first time it actually wants to go through the red light there. So if I re-engage, you want to take a bet? Is it going to go or is it just going to stay still? Let's uh, see. I think it might stay still now because of like the kind of weird position you're in. Okay, that oh, was okay. hard to do. Yeah, I don't <laughs> yeah. know. As soon as we I'll engage. I'll never it. know. <laughs> <laughs> so we have pedestrians, we have cyclists on the right side and she's trying to keep a distance while keeping on the lane. She has them like... Uh, like darkened no wait okay Whew, okay so we're good okay we're good cyclists uh we have a traffic light here she's looking at it it's in the path i'm giving her some jewels so she can continue going on and uh just so that she passes that and she's on her yeah. way now so that's good and we have some rain coming down too as well so we're gonna have some downtown footage in rain rainy conditions um you know you're getting the Not whole package super dark either <laughs> getting the whole package so don't forget to like subscribe <laughs> And click that notification bell because it is a stress test essentially. Yep. <laughs> it's stressing for both the for Ma Marsha as well as ourselves. <laughs> I had to give her some jewels. There's a pedestrian there. I think that yeah. might have been why. And that's the VR uh, VRU testing, vulnerable road unit testing, uh, to see how she reacts. So she was a little bit cautious with that pedestrian on on the left side there. It's gonna bump it up to 45. Okay. Nice. Just waiting for Marsha to actually use the windshield wipers. She's taking this corner really slow, and we had some what appeared to be um, pedestrian crossing lights, so she slowed down a little bit there. She takes a corner really well. This, oh, she's speeding up now. This corner pretty confidently too. As oh well. yeah, and she's she's not like you don't have to like push the jewels. No, I don't. Okay, she's indicating on. for high. Uh, one road. second. No, no, I think that's because our our destination. destination We're gonna take a location break. One sec. Oh, okay, so that was good, and we got some traffic lights too as well. Okay. I think the reason why she can she continued on with that red light was because of how quickly, uh, how abruptly we uh, engaged FSD. Mm. Um, she probably thought it was like a no point of return, and so yeah. wanted to cross it like that. The thing is, we were very close to the line, so yes. I think that's why. And then we engaged yeah. it. Yeah. But let us know, folks. Let us know what you think about that. If she should have just stopped abruptly and give us, you know, some full G's of, of braking. <laughs> so now we are off. We have a car on the right side. Ooh. He's trying to get into our lane. He's supposed to be remaining on his side. Yeah, these um, bikes are kind of driving a little wild, too. Yeah. To be honest. Okay. So we're supposed All to be right. going 40. Okay, nice. Yeah. I just want to bump it down to 40. It's a little bit, um, you know, we have rainy conditions. We have a lot of pedestrians on the right side. You can see a lot going on right now. Okay, we okay. can go, but we have this person oh! here a little bit on our side. Oh my gosh. In our lane. And she handled that pretty well. She didn't press, a, you know, brakes abruptly. She just kept her distance a little bit. And um, and then we were on our way. So that that's good. I think she should have honked. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> to be honest. Ideally, yes. Honk, get them back into their lane. But then they had pedestrian, they had cyclists on their right side. Uh, so it's a little bit tricky negotiating yeah. these narrow lanes. Okay, we're going. She kind of went a little bit to the right To the right there. side, yeah, yeah, that was a little bit. strange. A little bit strange, yeah. Uh, we're going to watch ourselves with these bikes. Because they're not watching us. <laughs> pedestrian crossing on the left side, but he's not in the road as yet. She slows them a little bit in anticipation, but then... Also, there's cars in front that have uh, completely stopped. Right, we're at a red light, so... Yeah. Okay, that was good. We can continue on. She should have position herself more to the left side here. Yeah. Okay, she kind of, she kind of corrects herself because it wasn't really immediately... Uh, 
apparent that the lanes were shifted to the left a little bit. Yeah. But, like, could you tell as a person or...? Not really, no. Okay. So she kind of reacted as you would. Yes, exactly. And there was no okay. jerkiness. A person coming in right behind us here, but not giving like a, a safe close. zone. Yeah, so not giving a safe follow distance between between ourselves. The other person was giving us a good follow distance. They, they were keeping themselves a little bit distance from us. And that's good, so that way I don't have to feather the, the pedal all the time. But now that you have these people up in your butt, <laughs> you have to kind of like toggle now the or, or feather the the pedal to keep or maintain that distance so they don't rear end you they have a last Whoa, minute pedestrian okay. here crossing the road in front of the streetcar the pedestrians on the right side and she's a little bit uh -oh. freaking out here too as well so she she just pressed some brakes and i'm giving her some jewels so she can continue on not too sure why she did that let us know in the comments if you if you saw what happened there but you can also see that for the uh oh yeah the, and this streetcar uh somebody told us that one of when, our subscribers yeah. yeah like when we have the barrier there that it's like kind of a free-for-all oh this is interesting oh she's trying to make sense of the lanes <laughs> uh yeah you she's don't indicating have to stop. left which should not be the case because it's confusing the car behind yeah i mean they're gone anyways so we're okay but yeah, they were saying like when, when there's a barrier there that we don't need to worry about stopping, that they will pretty much move themselves with the, the crossing lights, right? Exactly, because yeah. there's a center aisle, there's a center uh, piece here that's separating the streetcar completely from the traffic here. Yeah, if, they, if it stops, you, you don't have to stop completely and wait for them. Right. So it's good that she's following that rule. It would be good if, you know, we didn't have this centerpiece here and, and um, she followed the rules. There's a pedestrian in the middle. So now we have a pedestrian in the middle of the road. Okay, we need to go. Uh, she wants to avoid Ooh. him and okay. she does so really well. So that's good. She's a little bit okay, left okay. bias here. Yeah, this person is it was coming into our lane. Okay. She kind of had to do that, or else we would have gotten hit. That's good. That's good behavior. Yeah, that was really good. I was getting worried. I'm like, oh, where are they going? <laughs> the lanes change a lot on this road, right? Yes, it goes back and forth, and it's mm -hmm. uh, it's confusing. It's confusing for even a, a, a person who's new to downtown. Or even you is somewhat familiar. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, I'm more or less kind of new. <laughs> <laughs> so we have a whole bunch of pedestrians on the right side. We have we have some backup of traffic here. <laughs> and then we have that Queen's Key turn coming up in 600 meters. So that's going to be interesting to see. Traffic in front of us so we can get a little idea as to narrow roads, bumper-to-bumper uh, -bumper traffic ish still kind of flowing pretty well probably we have cars making left turns further up so this lane is clearing up a little bit yeah we're going a completely separate place than everyone else it's good how fsd works on hills like this because with smart someone you can't really use it on an incline like oh this. really yeah so that's a fun fact Probably in the future. Fun fact of the day. <laughs> <laughs> and that's the thing that, that uh, FSD has to realize. Um, you know, when you're in bumper to bumper traffic, you want to keep a following distance, but you don't want it to, to be long, like super long, because there's cars behind, and then also it can affect traffic flow. For example, there's a car to the left of me here. If I go up a little bit, the car behind me is going to move up and then you're going to have a car on the left side actually being able to make that left turn like we see right now. So if I didn't move up, those cars behind would have blocked that car from making a left turn. So that's a real yeah. world example right there. Well, I mean, when you're downtown, you want to like minimize the space between as much as possible. So even just high traffic scenarios. Mm -hmm. Like this is fine. Or probably if you go up a little bit, you know, probably like right here is fine. Once I'm seeing the red tires, should be fine. Mm. 
Nope, she oh. still don't that aggressively, but she could remain here, though. I would have remained behind the line, and once I see that the front is moving and, and there's space behind this line, this uh, crossing, pedestrian crossing, I would have I would have went. So that's another thing that it has to anticipate when there's congestion, giving room so that she doesn't get stuck in the intersection itself. And that's an awkward situation because then you block other cars that have to, to come in too as well. And that causes more traffic. <laughs> oh, so we have Queen's Key coming up, folks. Um, yeah. You know, right now you're probably thinking, is she going to make it? I mean, if we have a follow car, we might be able to make it. But maybe not because it's not really following the car so like closely anymore. It's like trying to do its own thing, right? Uh, well, it's not really dependent primarily on follow or lead cars. But mm -hmm. but if there's a car in front of it or in front of her, she should be able to just follow that car, and um, it will help with that navigation or that maneuver. Right. We'll see. We're coming up. And, um, hmm. interesting. So you want to go straight. This person wants to go right. This person wants to go left. And we're just trying to get through. Look at the new Prius, folks. Wow, looks really nice. It looks very nice, yeah. So we have to go straight. Okay. And she does that really well. Before, she got confused and was stuck behind these cars making left turns. Making oh, we're good, left we're turn. good. We're so this is really now. good. This is an improvement. So that's pretty sick. That was pretty. That, yeah. was, that was pretty good. But that Prius looks really nice. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> what is, is that? The Prime? I'm not too sure if it's the Prime, but did it pass already? That's a new one. Yeah. No, it's there. All right, here we go up to the infamous turn. Yes, and we have some lead cars. So sorry, you won't be able to see how Marsha navigates just by herself but i'm hoping that the team over the past couple of months they made they made some major changes in terms of the lane trajectory lane recognition and so on so what do you folks think are we, are we gonna make it <laughs> if it was a real <laughs> so worried about the the, the, the street car there oh my gosh there's so much going on oh if we have to make the turn with a street car okay how Oof. Okay, they're gone because they have to go. I don't know. Do they go with us? I think they go. Um, I think they parallel. go first. Okay, I don't know what. Happened. Okay, so we have cars <laughs> behind us now. Ooh, is there? Oh, there's no. Tr okay, they have a transit signal, so we're good. Okay. We're good. So we're Will making we just... the left turn now, giving us some juice because she's a little bit hesitant. This person is crossing. She the has street. to make the left turn. She's going. Ooh. She's going. There's random people crossing. Okay. But she makes it? What? What? Okay. That was the first time. Wow, well done. She was hesitant, but she made it. She did a good job. Well done. Oh, we gotta take a little location break and we'll be back. Yes. We are back. We did Welcome it. Welcome back again. And whoa, <laughs> so that was pretty good, folks. I mean, if you're not happy, I mean, I'm happy. <laughs> Cry is happy. The first time in how long? <laughs> she made how that really tests? well without any kind of hesitation. I mean, she hesitated, okay. but she she thought about it. Like I could see her being like, "Hmm, is it over there? Like, is it? What is this line?" And in our past uh, past software updates, uh, especially with V10, she used to get confused, or she she would actually get confused with these lanes here on the right side, um, considering these as like a as a lane, and we were on the on the wrong side of the road, right? So sometimes she would try right. to swerve to the right. Let's see if it happens still. Uh, I don't think it will uh, because I'm already seeing here that it's all grayed out. Oh, yeah. It's not even thinking this is a, a road on so the right So this is side. the improvements that we're seeing. This wow. is a random bus on the... On the <laughs> <laughs> a, a long... Uh, we have a, a limo. limousine. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Everybody so just go quickly. And she can okay. pick up some speed. I'm giving her some jewels so that way we can go forward with our, our life. <laughs> move on <laughs> with our lives so we have a narrow road in front of us we have a car trying to make a left turn yeah she needs to get into position and she does so beautifully wow really nice she's not even really freaking out with the, the car is a bit in our lane here 
Cow she's seeing well. this little bay here, but she's not. She's not getting freaked out. I'm this just is following amazing, this actually. random bus and then <laughs> it's just wiggling like this. <laughs> yeah, this is cool. This is cool. It really is. And before it seemed to be like the speed was locked to about thirty. So we had to. I had to constantly pedal. I'm sorry, constantly feather the uh, the pedal to get her up to speed. But we're not seeing that anymore. She's very nicely moving downtown here. Like I said, I'm I'm really impressed. Really, really impressed. Yeah, this this part is like really smooth, like just totally normal. Like it feels like you're driving it, or even better. <laughs> wow, and then look at the amount of pedestrians. It's a lot of graphics processing. <laughs> yeah, is it slowing down? Is it? I can see some frame drops there. We need to. Can you see the rickshaw? <laughs> is this a bike? <laughs> <laughs> hey, but in some countries they really do have a lot of rickshaws though, so that. Is important. To they will get trained for sure. Yeah. Wow, I'm just really happy. Really, very well done, Elon and, and AI team for doing this. It's working really well so far. Knock on fake wood. <laughs> Definitely gonna knock on fake wood. Oh yeah, and she's not like swerving into here or anything. Exactly. Yes. You can see here it's completely green. Also, out. knock on the fake wood, but. <laughs> okay, she is the case that she okay. wants to go left. Not necessary. Well, uh, kind of questionable, but it's not like bad. Yeah, it wasn't terrible. I don't think she should have come in here though. She should have waited. She should have waited had behind space. the line. Yeah. <gasps> oh, she's kind of going okay. into the side here. She got a little confused there, but, but then she, she fixed it. Yeah, she yeah. caught herself. So we're making an actual like left turn. Left turn. Making a right turn? No. No, she okay. won't because it's uh, it's separated for straight and okay. left. So she wanted to, um, to, she didn't have to indicate that to be honest, yeah, you could have just went straight. Yeah, she should have just gone straight, just not exited, basically. Look at this, we have... There's like tons of lights and stuff exactly. to be like, stop, don't go here. Was this always raised or was this uh, the same level as the road? Uh, that's a good question to be honest, I'm really not sure. We like, may have to go I back wonder. to our previous footage. If you're not sure, folks, check out our previous footage of downtown Toronto to see how it performed. Or the lack I feel like of now we're going to the real test. <laughs> so we have to make a left turn here now. She's a little bit blocked by the car in front. And uh, this is where we were talking about follow distance. I mean, they don't really have much uh, room. And they did go up, so that's good. So now she should be able to... Ooh, too close. Nah, she didn't. She didn't. I, ha I was a little bit hesitant there, so I'm going to have to disengage. And uh, and go. So she could have made that. I feel should like have got into lane position, indicate, and get into the left lane. There was room room to do it. I was a little bit concerned though about her averaging of the the car in front. Yes, of that, the edge there. It has to improve because because the the actual sensors, ultrasonics or even vision is not that accurate. It, it it's kind of tricky. Um, they can make a left turn, but there's, uh, no, yeah, there's, there's they cars can. blocking the left lane, so too bad for us. Um, I actually can't see like if they are or not. Yeah, the whole right lane. It's hard to see. There's yeah. blocked off. It's gonna be a tricky one, folks. We might have to make it on like a yellow light or something. Oh yeah, they're going up. I'm not too they're sure if she's gonna consider up. those cars in our lane there too as well. We gotta wait for all these people to go, and then there's somebody coming straight. Okay, yeah, there is only one lane because the ice cream truck is in the way. And they have right of way. Mm -hmm. So we can go. So we gotta go. We gotta go, yeah. So we have to go oh, now. There's some pedestrians. Uh, yeah, so we, we have gotta to let go. them go, and then we go. Yeah. Whew, okay. Alright, so I had to give us some jewels, of course, all the way through that left turn there. That's that was a, a difficult tricky maneuver, one, yeah. A very difficult maneuver to make. So. Super tricky. But she did all the turning, everything. That was that was good. I mean, nice. once you get training over time, this should be done by the system, by her. Yeah. Oof. So <laughs> that was um. I mean, so far I'm just really impressed. <laughs> really impressed. Really big improvements took place within the past couple of uh, um, well, the past month or two, a couple months. Yeah, we had a, a test before where we came here and then we ended up having to just leave because it wasn't working in the rain 
Oof, that was a little bit bad there because uh, she oh. had to stay on the left side here. Oh my goodness, we're in the left turn oh, lane. That's probably why she wanted to go here and oh, we have to stop. stop. Yeah. Oh boy, that was rough. <laughs> that was mostly our errors Oh my gosh, well. that person just broke the red light. Wow, so that was rough. That was rough. Yeah. I, I think she was actually on the right path and I made a human error. So that was impressive. Yeah. But there was a lot going on too as well. Mm hmm you know, we have a cyclist very, to very the right close. of us. We have a car in front of us that's parked up on the right side. Oof. Let's see how Marshall tackles this. Yeah, I was saying before, remember, uh, we had to leave here because it just was not working with the little bit of rain. Exactly. Yeah. We had some sprinkles. I mean, now it has stopped completely, so we really can't test that now. But I'm pretty sure that she would be able to to get through that with some sprinkles. Yeah, I think so too. I mean, you can see, folks, that it is major improvement from our last run. We might have some jaywalkers. We have cyclists on the right side, really close to us. At least she's identifying the lane for the for the. Um, okay. Oh, yeah, but she's a little bit close to the actual. Because of the well, she's worried about too the... close to the cars on the left because of cyclists. So now she should see that car in front of us start indicating to get into the left lane. Or at least swerve around them. I think she is, but okay. she shouldn't be doing it in the line, though. I think she should have just indicated. That was fine. She uh, was in, still in, within our lane. Okay. And, but the only thing is that she didn't really keep a, a safe distance from the car on the right side. Okay, there's like a million people here. Let's see what's going to happen. First of all, I'm going to slow it down. Okay, she swerved away from them, I think. Really prioritizing the safety of pedestrians. Really good. Let um, me get a nice red light. <laughs> so we might have to disengage uh, soon. We'll see because... No, actually I think when it, we, we're able to make a right usually, but it probably depends. I'm going to say that I, I kind of trust the navigation data now because it has improved substantially before before the very first time when we tried it downtown oh it actually goodness. it actually took us on to a one-way a one-way street yeah that was really bad and we were going in the opposite direction so that was a little bit rough <laughs> to say the least even the camera over here the camera was stressed <laughs> <laughs> all right so we can go here we have pedestrian oh. on the left this side guy's here. not even watching where he's walking uh, he literally didn't even look at us Marshall looked to the left, saw that there was room, and then she tried to avoid the pedestrian because it was a little bit tricky. Right. From that. Oof. She's slowing down here completely. I'm not too sure if we reached our destination or... Ah, uh, no, we didn't. So I'm not too sure why she's slowing we down. We still got a little ways to go. This... She has a tendency Ooh. of going on and swerving to the left side. I mean, I mean it's I an over-precaution. I kind of agree. I, honestly, like, the, the pedestrians are really close to the road, some of them. And it's very unpredictable, too, as well. Yeah, she you don't know what down. they're going to do. Yeah, this person wants person to make a right turn oh here gosh. on a busy street. Yeah, we're going to be stuck here for a while. <laughs> she wants to make a left turn, but there's cars on our left side, too, as well. Okay, so uh, we got to I had to disengage there. Turning wheel into the, the next... The, the adjacent lane when there are cars flowing on the left side is very dangerous you could get hit easily right so wow <laughs> well tesla's getting some good training data here we're <laughs> seeing how she's reacting to these vr views for sure and um we're impressed I'm, I'm impressed so far in terms of her interaction with these variables these objects I mean, I, I, don't need, I don't need to objectify people, but <laughs> <laughs> what I mean. not do that. <laughs> yeah, but at least she's not telling us to make a left here. That's all I'm happy about. Exactly, yeah. So far, the, the navigation data seems to be on point, like, like really good. It's yeah. really good. I love, like, I'm really, really happy. <laughs> like, I don't know if you're, I'm, I'm going to constantly say it. Like, I'm really happy so far. She's a little okay. bit freaked out with the pedestrians on the right side. and she She's really continues. cautious, but it, honestly, it's not terrible. Well, we have some, we have a driver here. Okay, they just reversed to make that uh, U-turn. And she's anticipating from, from a while away. Like, all the way back there. She was anticipating how they were behaving. Yeah, she's kind of uh, really overly cautious here and she's slowing down you know with a huge gap in between the car in front so i had to give her some some jewels there i no longer have to do that so that's fine but 
it's uh it's it's interesting <laughs> yes it's, it's very awkward okay so we have pedestrians on the right side so he's going to try to swim to the left try to avoid them but then we have this person here on the right side oh, on the left side trying to get into a lean so it's a little bit awkward that behavior she wants to try to get in the left lane here i guess she's not showing it on the screen uh, uh i don't know why she's i think you need to turn that off yeah i'm gonna have to disengage that not disengage the the actual but just FFC. take off the uh... yeah she needs to start getting into the this is a side. tricky situation here with what's going on because yeah. a lot is going on so i have to cancel that left lane change and we have a really tight corner here too as well and she's going at it she's indicating in the speed. corner oh she needs to stop doing that because it's confusing people yeah we have a car coming up behind us so i'm giving her some jewels so she can go cancelling um, that that lane change so she can stop indicating and but she's just cars indicating behind. though it's not, it's not even like she's actually planning to do anything i had to manually uh cancel so that we lane change. may have to go around okay this is okay okay she so gets herself into position She's seeing a car already in front of us that's parked yeah, to the park, right. So yeah. that was good anticipation there on good lane positioning. So that was good. Not to show why she's indicating left. Um, she needs to take that off. Yeah. <laughs> First of all, that's a one way, ma'am. <laughs> so we're off. I have to give her some jewels. She's not picking up the traffic light here for some strange reason. She now picks it up, which was really strange. She wants to get back into the right lane because we have to make a oh, right turn. Oh, bird. I was trying to see if it was going to see the bird, but it didn't. Okay, I think this is the place where we're okay to make a right, but not... Okay, this person... I'm not too sure why she's turning her wheel, though. Okay. It's a tricky one. We don't normally go here in the day. Yeah, it's a lot. It's a lot, again, going on here. And then we have a congested right turn. So it's going to take a while for us to make this turn. She can creep up. Uh, oh, why did we roll back so much? Yeah, she has to be careful here. Uh -oh, so, okay. uh, she's not picking up. I'm not too sure she's picking up that uh, street car. Or the bike. She is. Hold on, careful, careful. These guys have, have right away to walk. So... We gotta okay, wait. She's gonna have to wait now. So that was a little bit tricky. And I had to disengage there too as well. And then these guys are confused if they're even crossing the road at all. So I'm gonna give it some jewels because we can start okay. getting in ourselves in position to make okay. that lane change. And yeah. nice. we're stuck oh, here. Oh, oh. And ah. she goes okay. over really well. Wow, Oof. okay. That was close. That was quick and too as well. Okay. And I do apologize if we disconnect. The car should, um, Marshall should be seeing if there's a car parked up there. Okay, so that was good. Yeah. Good lane change. There's no turns here. I think Oof, we, we have pedestrians straight. making, um, they're crossing the road. And look at this, folks. This is Dundas Square. It's going to be ridiculously busy. And she's very cautious with pedestrians. You can see her trying to, like, avoid a pedestrian by making a wide a wide turn around them really close really close to the cars on the left side because of so much pedestrians on the right side yeah and it's kind of freaking out the, the cars bus. on the left right behind me too as well um this is a really tight street and we have even cyclists too as well and there's also like a million people <laughs> it gets a little bit bigger here now so it's yeah. fine but she, she doesn't need to indicate on these high curvature rules but uh, i'll be uh, actually no she's right you want to make a right turn coming up in 50 meters so that's fine whoa okay <laughs> she's watching more than we are <laughs> yeah exactly giving us some jewels just so that she can go up but i just we're actually off. making a right here today yeah exactly so we're just so these cars behind me will they're gonna have to overtake me or well, unless they're making a right turn too as well right so we have a gap there and then there's now some people going. Uh, yeah. No. Okay. That was a little bit tricky. I don't know why these folks cross at this time. Okay. I think so, we got a little space. Yeah, yeah we can go now. There's people just walking across the street normally. Oh, we have police right behind us. I'm just trying to keep uh, my side. I mean, the, the jaywalker should be worried about the police. <laughs> just checking to see if they're But they're not. 
Okay, so we have this random person bringing some Uber Eats. DoorDash. DoorDash. Not sponsored yet. <laughs> <laughs> One day. <laughs> okay, so we are coast is clear. No more police in the area. <laughs> <laughs> okay, everybody could get back up in their seats. <laughs> okay, so we're going now. Let's go. Oh, we have a bump here. Ooh. Oh, Ooh. that was way more dramatic than I was expecting it to be. <laughs> <laughs> Got a little tour. We are almost done with mm -hmm. our stress testing here. We have our <laughs> final train coming up on Adelaide Road in 300 meters. And uh, yeah, we just have to disconnect there because these uh, action cameras have a tendency of overheating. So sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I mean, I mean, final thoughts before we make this turn coming up soon. Um, so far, pretty good. I mean, the overcautious is like not a huge issue, to be honest. And honestly, and really downtown, like all these kind of things you see happening. So <laughs> you do really need to be careful. Exactly. It's I mean, it's not a, not a big issue at all. But overall, like, are you seeing the major improvements that I've been seeing? Yeah, like, um, it looks like, um, uh what's it called queen's key was mapped pretty well and i think that was what we had the issue with the last time yes um because it lacked the mapping and that's why it was like just going super super slow it was freaking out and and like this how this part was completely just not even on like it was just completely grayed out showing as like something else that was really good yes i mean it shows <laughs> that they're listening it shows that elon and team team ai are working hard on getting these things mapped out Ultra and fixed hard. <laughs> ASAP. So that was yeah. really good. That was really good. And that was only a course of a couple of, probably a couple of months, like one or two months. Mm -hmm. So this is drastic, drastic improvements, really good performance around the uh, vulnerable road units, the VRUs, really impressed so far. Um, I just want to thank, thank the team. If Tesla and, and employees are watching. And Musk we trust. <laughs> <laughs> But yes, really, really so impressive. Far. <laughs> so far. So we have our left turn coming up. Just the in last 100 meters. One. She's a little bit hesitant still, slowing down. Um, and we have a weird turn here. This is actual. Oops. This is a one way. Yeah, we can't make that now. We have a red light. I honestly don't get the point of these one ways downtown. <laughs> it's just adding more complexity. <laughs> and you can't go straight either, so you kind of have to go left. But this is strange here because we have, uh, I believe we have two lanes. You could have, probably go on the left two side. Or two or three lanes. And right. we have construction on the on the right side, some construction cones. So it'll be interesting mm -hmm. to see which lane she chooses and if there's a lot of hesitation with the left turn too as well. Yeah, because this is a one way and she should know. Oh, it looks like she's actually choosing, choosing the leftmost lane, which is, I think, correct. Make the left turn. Either the middle or the left leftmost lane would, would be fine. I yeah, mean, if because we had we're these... by ourselves. Yeah, anyways. exactly. Are we All right, right let's away? go. We have right of way. We can go. She's okay. a little bit hesitant at first. She couldn't make it here. I'm going to get honked at. Oh, okay. And she picked she... the rightmost. Ooh, very oh, close to the Very cones. close to the cones, but Whoa, she picks okay. up and she's speeding <laughs> too as well. So I'm going to slow she... that down here. <laughs> she really zoomed there for a second. And on that note, folks. <laughs> Thank you for tuning in. As always, don't forget to like, subscribe, share with your friends and folks. <laughs> the child is telling, telling us, us to stop. stop. Telling Marsha to slow down. <laughs> Take Didn't care, Did Marsha folks. understand that? <laughs> stop. What a journey. What a trip, folks. All right. All Take right. care and enjoy. Have a good one and stay safe. Bye. Bye.